outside, he'll kick him from the inside. He'll stay way the fuck away from any sort of a range where Floyd can punch him. It'll be a completely alien range for Floyd. And every time Floyd goes in, front kick to the stomach. Boom, front kick to the stomach. Boom, front kick to the stomach. How many of those can you take? Okay, boom, inside leg kick. Boom, outside leg kick. He's laughing at you now. Now he's talking shit and you realize you gotta get past those legs. You can try to close the distance. Boom, spinning back kick to the liver. Fuck! <laughs> what are you gonna do now? What are you gonna do now? You're gonna be picked apart until he decides to take you to the ground and cut your face open with elbows. <laughs> How about that? How about he pins your right arm down with his left shin, gets on top of you, and just starts smashing the edge of the elbow into your eye sockets, into your nose, cuts across your forehead, slices you open like a fucking melon. You don't have a chance. No one has a chance that hasn't had a long history of grappling and getting kicked. It's like you're a regular boxer is like especially the best ever like Floyd is phenomenal at what he does But if you put takedowns and kicks into that it changes everything it changes everything He'd be fucked I want This is a oh, in my opinion. This is a 40% proposition Which means it's 40% likely that he might actually do this the reason why he might do this is because I think they will give him an un godly sum of money. I mean an ungodly sum. And I think they should. And I think that if uh, the UFC can talk Floyd Mayweather into going into an MMA ring, first of all, they should give him everything they can get their greasy paws on to get him to fight Connor in an MMA fight. Just say, look, we can give you CM Punk. We'll give you CM Punk for half a, half a bill. Half a billion. This is a lot of money, but you can go through that in five years. Instead, how about we give you Conor McGregor for a full billy? And we'll give you six to eight months to practice yeah. jiu-jitsu. Six, <laughs> six to eight months to just figure out how you're going to get oh, God, fucked man. up. You'd be screwed. He, he wouldn't just be screwed. That's, like, that's unfair to, like, for people that have been screwed. You would need a way more, <laughs> way more outrageous example it's not just getting screwed. What he's he would like someone said it should be a, a thousand to one. That's not high enough. <laughs> it's not high enough. If Conor McGregor was going to fight Floyd Mayweather in MMA, it is as close to one hundred percent as anything ever gets ever. Because if you think Floyd is all of a sudden going to become this fucking one punch destroyer like John the Beast Mugabe in the 1980s or whatever the fuck that was if you think that's gonna happen out of nowhere you're crazy that's not what's gonna happen what's gonna happen is he's probably gonna punch Connor in the face a couple of times it's probably gonna suck but Connor's gonna get a hold of him and then he's gonna be like a baby I don't think he's gonna fight McGregor ever in MMA but I think he might fight CM Punk I believe that I believe that could happen I know they're not even that's not even like official talk but I really believe that can happen it sounds crazy I know but the whole thing sounds crazy it sounds crazy to think that he could fight anybody in MMA that he would be willing to do it he must know something because <laughs> he could just go into boxing he must know that he's his time as a boxer is just done and just got Floyd to the ground and just got his neck it's super super possible that he could win like it's possible that he could win but it's also possible that Floyd can win that's what makes that interesting because Floyd is still one of the best boxers of all time if not the best still a fucking elite athlete still light speed in the, in there like with his footwork and his movement his head movement he's so fast he's gonna be way faster than CM Punk so if CM Punk can't get a hold of him and every time he moves in he gets his face lit up pop up pop up with a dude who's fast as fuck with six ounce gloves now he's got four ounce gloves on very little padding and he's catching you right on the chin pop and you can't do shit about it. You're trying to close the distance, and he's stutter-stepping and moving in front of you. And CM Punk is not, like, the best kicker in the world. I'll buy it.